I went because I knew that it would stretch me and grow my faith. And so when I went, I knew it was not going to be easy. I knew that it would require leadership to do things and to step up. And I said, bring it. There was options to build things. There was options to go to door to door at these little huts where people actually lived. And you can explain the gospel in Spanish. If you don't know Spanish, no problem. There's usually transla translators and most of the people there speak Spanish. A lot of people who go on the trip speak Spanish. And so that's an opportunity. There's also opportunity for uh, vacation Bible school. And it was there like five or six houses later where we shared the gospel one more time. And after all that mountain climbing, after all the, the talking about the gospel and every door was shut, this person at the house decided they wanted to surrender their life to the Lord. That was pretty awesome. It's not about it's not about the vacation aspect of it. It's really about stepping out of your comfort zone and stepping into God's comfort zone. It's a tough trip, not gonna lie. Um, five days with no shower and it's kind of really crazy, but um, I guess we all kind of smelled together, so it wasn't a big deal. Friends would smell together, stay together. I was in a group with like five people and we had an interpreter, and so we were just hiking and hiking and hiking, and um, we got really discouraged because we couldn't find any huts, and um, we just were like, okay, well, maybe we should just turn back and go back to to Green and go back to our base and just, you know, try again tomorrow. Um, we went a little bit longer and we ran into this man. And he was, we were like, hey, are there more huts up there? And he's like, yeah, just keep going a little bit. And so um, instead of turning back, we just kept going a little bit further. And we ended up running into this whole village of like 30 huts and getting to talk to people. And it's just really cool to see that even though we were so discouraged, we just kept going and doing what the Lord was asking us to do. And um, he provided for us and we got to talk to so many people and invite them to the movies we had at that night and it was just really cool.